In this video, we are going to learn about different types of graph. Types of graph. We have pictograph, line graph, bar graph, and pie chart. And we are going to discuss them individually. Pictograph. This is a pictograph. Pictograph uses pictures to represent data in a simple way. Look at this pictograph. It's showing the number of mangoes sold in a week. These are the days of the week. And these are number of mangoes sold. At the bottom is the scale used. A picture represents two mangoes. Now let's look at the pictograph and find out when the largest cell was made. The largest cell was made on Monday. And the least cell was made on Friday. This is also a pictograph. Different fruits we are used to represent data. So you can use different fruits and represent the data as a pictograph. Pie chart. This is a pie chart. Some graphs are called charts. Pie chart shows how a whole is divided into different parts. Percentages are used to show how much of the whole each category occupies. Look at this pie chart. It's showing various crops grown in a village. At the right side are the crops grown. Look at the chart. You will see how they are allocated. How many percentage each of the crops is grown. Rice, 35%, yam, 25%, okra, 10 wheat, 5%, and potatoes, 24%. Now let's find out which of the crops did the village grow more. Looking at the pie chart, it is rice because it is 35%. And which one is the least crop they grow. According to the chart, it is wheat because it has only 5%. Line graph. This is a line graph. Line graph shows information on how things changes over time. This graph is showing the temperature on the 10th of June. At the left side, the numbers show the temperature in degrees and each small line is 5 degrees. At the bottom is the time of the day. The black line shows how the temperature changes at each time. Now let's find out the temperature at 10 o'clock. Remember this at the time of the day. What is the temperature at 10 o'clock? Let's follow it. The temperature is at 30 degrees. And at 2 o'clock, temperature went up to 45 degrees. Bar graph. This is a bar graph. A bar graph displays data using bars of different heights. This bar graph shows men's favorite color. At the left side, the numbers represent the number of votes. The bottom shows the colors. Each bar has a different color. We have red, blue, yellow, and a purple. The top of the bars shows the number of votes for each bar. Now let's find out the color that has the highest vote. Looking at the bars, blue has the highest vote. How many votes has it got? 20 votes. And which color has the smallest vote? Red. Red has got only 5 votes. Thank you for listening. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like and share with friends.